Color correction in Godot isn't the most obvious thing, so I'm going to show you a quick way to do color correction. So go to your world environment node. If you don't have one, you can right click and make a new world environment and then set up your world environment to your liking. And the first thing we're going to go to is our tone map. We're going to change that to Aces, but you can also do Filmic and Reinhardt or early near but i like aces me personally it just looks the best and we can drop this exposure down since it is just a tiny bit bright i drop it down to 0 0.9 and then we can go to this adjustments field open that up and enable it and then do drop the brightness down here and crank the contrast up to 1.1 and that creates just a more cinematic look for our scene and we can go to our color correction field right here right now it says empty but we can set to any one of these things i use a gradient texture 1d but a curve XYZ texture also works as well. I'm going to show you how to do both, by the way. So we'll start off with a gradient texture 1D. So on the left, we have our shadows, and on the right, we have our highlights. So if we change this white to a more bluish color, we can see that our scene is starting to take on a bluish tint. And if I bring our shadows up a little bit, we can see that our shadows are becoming more pronounced and that just creates a more cinematic look. But we can also use a curve XYZ texture, which right now it just turns our scene pink, but we can create curves in it the x y and z and then we can create the points within these curves so it's red green and blue for x y and z and this gives us much more finer control over our individual channels so if we want our blue to i guess stand out more we can just bring this over here it, it, it's a little bit more finicky than the gradient texture but if you know what you're doing you can get the results i i'm not personally the biggest fan of this method but as you can see here we can certainly make changes to our scene with it so if you found this video informative and in any way be sure to leave a like and subscribe. It helps out. Channel helps get content like this. Recommend others. That's all for me for now. Fun number out. Oh yeah, and here's a side by side comparison of the starting scene versus the scene with a color correction gradient applied to it.